Hello, and I'm here with a tutorial again. Um, this one is a very, very, very simple tutorial. Um, and that is playing games in a windowed mode that looks full screen. Now, this may be helpful for if you stream um because you want to have you want to be able to click off the game into a chat room or you want to sort out xsplit or you want to sort out your streaming program and you want to have the ability to click out of your game to do that with well it's very easy to do all you need to do is download a program and it's called da games window relocator <clears throat> say that again games window relocator and it's a really cool program and it works it really does so I'll show you with a commercial game because I know if I do something stupid like Melty Blood people will be like what? so I'll show you with a more commercial game such as RE6 so here we go we're loading up RE6 right now the quality should be good because I am using my Avamedia Avamedia XSplit combo so it shouldn't be that terrible, hopefully. If it ever loads. The hell? It seems to have crashed. It's weird. For real now, you're gonna fuck up the tutorial? Oh, oh, no, no. Oh, 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 there it is. Okay, we finally got Resident Evil. It's finally alive. Okay, we wanna skip all this Capcomness. Okay, so what you want to do is okay, the quality it's going to be lagging as hell. I wouldn't even want to try and play it. Okay, yeah, I've got everything on high, and obviously it doesn't like my streaming program. Okay, you need to shut up. Okay, so what you do is you really you can move your your window anywhere you want to, any way you please. Like I could have it up here, but I won't. I'll just have it over here. So we want to click on games for window game gamers gamers window relocator is that it I said games I think it's gamers though we'll find out gamers window relocator okay I was close enough so what you can do here now is options now what you want to do is get your monitor resolution and just punch it into here. Mine is 720p, so 1280 by 720. And it is, yep, there's the link for it, I suppose, if you want to. Uh, let me just get a, let me just, let me, fucking, let me just get a uh, close-up of that. So you all can see. That doesn't help much, does it? There we go. There you go, there's the link. Wonderful little program. Now, once that's done, you can select your game from the list, relocate, and bang, you've got a windowed, full-screen game. Now, I know what you're thinking, but when I click off, my start bar shows. Easy enough. Easy enough. Keep taskbar on top of the windows, unclick. And you may need to redo it, because that'll change the size, so... You have to click. You have to click release, and then relocate, and boom, you've got it back. So now you can click off the game, click onto it, click off, click on to your heart's content. Now, why would you want to do this outside of streaming? Because sometimes putting the game in a window reduces the load on the system. Sometimes. And, um, you know, it, it, as long as you're not using fraps, you can click out and, uh, you know, look at, a, look at a guide or something. So it's very handy, and especially if you're streaming. But really, as well, it can be used outside of recording, because I have a game called Tony Hawk Pro Skater 3. Now, that doesn't actually support a 720p resolution. But I put it to whatever the lowest resolution I could, or the highest, which wasn't very high at all. And then I got the gamer's window relocator, relocated the window, and it was full screen and perfect. So it has many different applications and uses for games. 
and is very handy, very helpful. So I would recommend this program to anybody looking for windowed full screen stuff. Or even just to put a window into something, you know, that's that it, that you know that's not a support a supported resolution. So it's very handy, very good, and I'll leave the link f for download in the description. It doesn't contain any viruses, and obviously it works. So shop with confidence with John Candy forty five in his love dungeon. Yeah. If you found this informative, if you found it helpful, give it a like, subscribe, um, share the video around and all that kind of stuff, and I'm out. Thank you for watching. Bye.